Welcome everyone to Fallout 76. So this this is a game that you know has received a lot a lot of negative press. How are you doing, Mikkel? How are you doing, Erica? Uh, and I I really want to see how much of it is real, how much it's not. Obviously, there's a lot of stuff surrounding it uh, right now. I'm trying. I'm not gonna really think too much about that. I want to see the game for what it is. That's what I'm curious about. I want to see how much of what everyone's been saying is real, how much it's is an exaggeration, and how much maybe is even not enough. So that's honestly what I wanted to do here. And it's something that I have been growing more and more curious for quite a while. Okay, so <laughs> I was just playing Pokemon. Nice. There's a game, Pokemon Evolution, for Samsung devices. What? Is it, like, fake? There's a settlement that needs your help. No. No. Also, another thing. I'll be playing this solo. And, you know, the big thing was that, as you can even see with the, with the little thing over there, it's all about, you know, playing with your friends and stuff like it. But, uh, you know, I don't know anyone that has the game. <laughs> Otherwise, if you do have the game, I would love to play with you. Uh, but yeah, another thing, I just immediately saw it with this little icon here. There are microtransactions, and I want to see how intrusive they are to this game. Um, that is something that I am curious about. In fact, I'm, I'm even going to click the social here. I want to see, okay, so this is just, this is nothing to do with the microtransactions. Okay, cool. I don't have any friends. Uh, credits? No, that's the game credits. But yeah, alright, let's, let's get started. But yeah, hope everyone is having a great Saturday. Uh, I hope you're, you're all doing well. Also, one thing that you, you guys are actually not getting, I have Riva Tuner showing me the stats and the performance of the game. I want to see if my computer in its current state can run it. I put it on medium. It's on the medium presets, and I increase the slider of the fade ends a little bit. So we'll see how that goes. If my computer is having a really easy time, I, I'll maybe bump it up, but we'll see. Fallout 76. <laughs> and it... <laughs> it's become such a notorious game. <laughs> War. War never changes. In 1776, this great nation accepted that armed conflict was the only way to preserve our rights to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Our founding fathers could only see us now. This seems to be in game. Well, not this now. But Okinawa to Anchorage. Didn't seem to be pre recorded. And now, the red menace is at our doorstep. Or it's just really high quality video. Democracy itself is under threat of annihilation. That is why today, July 4th, 2076. <laughs> Look how derpy they are. 300 years after our great nation began, we gather together to honor the completion of Vault 76. This you have friends, Rod, in high places. May have been engineered by Vault so much backlash and negativity. Yeah. By you, the good people of America. So that if the bombs do come, if the end does come, our way of life will endure. Also, one thing that bothered me a lot, just on a lore concept level... Must be our best and our I'll, I'll just talk about this later. For when the fighting has stopped, and the fallout has settled, you must rebuild. Not just walls, not just buildings, but hearts and minds. And ultimately, America itself. So as we stand here today, we pray that the world will know peace. I don't know this game, so that what's it about? Destiny, it's Fallout survival game, pretty much. Multiplayer. You can play it with friends. No one. But, here in but it's, 76, it's gotten so much negative attention. Future begins. 
it's gotten so much negative attention and negative press just because of so many problems, lies with pre-orders, and what comes in like the super expensive collector's edition that was like 200 bucks. Uh, <clears throat> let's see the the presets we have here. Is this still like, yeah. This is... Overseer, shut up! <laughs> I'm trying to... Ponytail? That's the standard for this game? All the other Fallout games were successful and this one failed so hard. Yeah. This one was like, this is the black sheep. People absolutely hate this guy. This guy. <laughs> this game. <laughs> um, oh. It's weird how the wrinkles move. Well, one thing, like, it doesn't look that much better, the models, I'll be honest, but it does look better. If you've played Fallout 4, this does look mildly better. <laughs> it looks less blobby. Fallout 4 faces were kind of blobby. They were good. I actually liked them and their art style, but uh, they were blobby. I, I found them to be really blobby, so... Alright, so one thing I, I do want to do is something I always try to do with games that have supposedly robust uh, character creation, and it is to try to create myself. I think this guy probably has the closest. None of them are close to what I look like, but I think I'll just go with that guy and work from there. Th this guy. <laughs> Over to your let rods talk. But yeah, so... One thing that was... Ooh, makeup. Makeup. Wait, can I not edit the face? Can I... Okay, I can. Alright. I, I was like, wait a second. <laughs> uh... Okay, this moves. Oh man, this is. I think I have like a little bit wider, like rounder. Yeah, this guy has like very kind of face. I feel like my. It's not sharp, but it's rounder. You need some blush rods. Ooh. Ooh. F. Yeah, I was pressing the wrong thing. No, I think I think that was better. Whatever I did. It was a little bit a little bit on the wider like look at me, it's <laughs> It's not pointy, that's the thing. It's I don't have a pointy like jawline. It's just rounder. And this is definitely not... Yeah, there we go, there we go, that's... Also, I don't have, like, very strong cheekbones? Make him look super deformed. Alright. Go right around there. Let's get really in depth. Well, my nose is not nearly that big. 
I got a big nose. It's, it's not that big. What is that? What does this do? I think mine is higher up. Eyebrows are completely wrong, too. I think I have a big forehead. But that's the thing, it's kind of round. Boosh! Welcome. Welcome. I think mine is, goes a little bit up, up, right? It's not like a sad eyebrow, it's... <laughs> oh, that's changing my eyes. I wanted to change my eyebrows. I have alert five right now. Shrewd. Oh, I'll go with this. Okay, eyebrows type. There we go, there. Now we can try to find one. I got decently thick eyebrows, I think. What does this look like? Still kind of thin for mine. <laughs> this is good enough. Okay. No, dude. I, I go all in, man. <laughs> when we character create, we character create. Maybe our average dark? Wait, what am I doing? What does that change? What? <laughs> oh man. Well, I have to change the schnoz. It's so big. How do I... <laughs> Don't put yourself through an hour creation. It is true. It is true. Like, I have no idea if I'm gonna... If I'm gonna be playing this game. How much I'm gonna be playing this game, so... This is... Oh yeah, I do have a... I don't have a very long face. I don't know. <laughs> you know what? You know what? I think, I think that is a... Uh, I think, I think Mikkel is right actually. The more I think about it. Let's just, let's just choose a girl. Pick, pick a cute pre... <laughs> um, preset. And let's go. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna go with face four. Let's get some cool hair in here. Poodle skirt. Anchorage. They added a few hairstyles here. That's a short mohawk. Or rude ridge. This okay, it's a bun type. Sultry, oh <laughs> Nuclear Breeze M Fatal that's this is one of the classics for Agent X. This is also one of the classics. Elegant is one of the classics, too. I really... I don't like this one. <laughs> I like short hair. Is a fan of short hair. You know what? I'm just gonna go with this. Muscular. <laughs> it, it gets so exaggerated. 
Oh, it doesn't like moving ass. Oh, this is weird. <laughs> Average. <laughs> All right. Oh, you know what? Since this is d a default hero, I kind of I kind of need it. I always whenever I'm in a game and there's a default hero, I make default hero Sam. And default hero Sam has a look, um, which just includes there being red hair, so. <laughs> now this is officially default hero. Is this red? Yeah, it's fine. Default hero Sam. Uh, yeah, this is good. I actually don't know if I like this. <laughs> oh no, it's happening. I can't, I can't stop myself. No nonsense. No, I'm going to go. I'm going to go with elegant. Because it is elegant. All right. So, default hero Sam. Here we go. Sam. How do I toggle menu? Oh, wait. How how do I control the menu? She's gone. <laughs> uh, is it the, oh wow, okay. Okay, that, that's a field on, off, strength, let's bump up the strength. That is doing nothing. <laughs> I just wanted some cool depth of field. Oh, there we go. All right. Show player, just turn it off. Expression, afraid, amused, angry, odd, concerned, confident, disgust, flirting, friendly, happy, impressed. Th that's impressed, please. Irritated, neutral. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Pose category. Wait, we gotta zoom out. What? I, I kind of like the idea of... I like the idea of someone with, with their eyes closed. <laughs> How do I move the camera down again? There we go. Let's see if there was anything else. Um, Z. Okay. Texture. Okay. 
I'll put some film grain on there. Frame. Oh. Okay. Yeah, this is... Alright, we're good. We're good. Um, press photo mode. I and pressing T. Okay. All right. Hey, Curl. <laughs> Welcome. So yeah, we are checking out. Whoa, it's too sensitive. <laughs> How do I change that? I can't see the prompt because I have, uh, okay, settings, controls, nope. Is that E? What's the letter there? I can't see it. I have the, th I have stats on the corner. <laughs> How am I doing? Doing all right, doing all right. I, I'm actually very excited because I, I really wanted to, to um, Z, Z for menu. Okay, thank you. Uh, I wanted to really try this game out and figure out how bad slash good it is. So, mm. so way too sensitive. Okay, settings. Yeah, this is the kind of stuff you can't really, like, fix before you get started. You you kind of have to... Wow. This game is really sensitive. Really sensitive. Is this minimum? Yeah, this, this is good. <laughs> Alright. Oh yeah, how are you doing? You're doing crawl and boosh. Saw you shut up there. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna. I'm definitely gonna take this slow. I want to take this in, see everything we have to see here, because that that's really the point. I'm not trying to get to a certain part of the game or anything like that. I want to see. I want to see details. I want to see everything. I want to really experience the game. And in many ways, play it how I would play it. I'm a very, like, exploratory kind of player with these kinds of games. Being a fan of the older Fallouts, I... Oh, you can flush. That's a plus. <laughs> can you even turn on the shower? Whoa, okay. Bathroom, bathroom check. Bathroom check. I don't like this song very much. Uh... Terminal. Oh, can we can we zoom in a little bit? Can we zoom in a little bit? That's a little bit far for me. Reclamate happy reclamation day. Just a little tired, no sleep. I feel you. I did not sleep too much. Again, three days in a row. But it, by choice. If you had to do it for work, I am sorry. <laughs> Uh, today is the day, everyone. Reclamation Day. We've been preparing for this moment for 25 years. We're ready. You're ready. America is waiting for us, so let's get out there, Overseer. You're invited. Countdown to Reclamation Day. Who? Everyone. When? 10 p.m. to midnight. We've opened the remaining liquor rations and the official vault -Tec party hats. The Overseer will give a speech at 10 minutes to midnight. And we'll lead the countdown. Have fun, everyone. Okay. Play holotape. Get ready to serve. How do I serve? Okay, I get it. <laughs> Quick game? Yes. Uh, eject holotape. 
I want to keep that. That's a fun game. I, I used to play a lot of those those types when I was was in uh, <laughs> in the flash days. Anyway, one thing, just one quick thing, and then I'm gonna I'm getting out of here. Uh, this game actually had a FOV slider. I know it was not here at launch, but this already makes it better than, in that specific aspect, better than any other Fallout game, which you had to go into the any files to change the FOV. So It does mess up some of the animations, apparently. <laughs> so they did not... So your arms are attached to your FOV. So we're going to see some janky things. <laughs> Left shift to open your pit boy. Okay. Okay, this seems pretty standard. This seems pretty standard. All right. Reminds me of an old Game & Watch, yeah. Exactly. Like, old Flash game, old Game & Watch. Okay, it's dropping frames already. She's kind of scary. I don't like her. Did you hear that? That's creepy. Whoa. This looks too futuristic for Fallout. Alright. Can I pick up a balloon? No. Okay. <laughs> Weird activation of coffee thing. Stove, use. Alright. <laughs> you can do the usual, just click whatever. Although it's not letting you pick up anything at this point. Um, and it is, it's at 45 frame rate right now. Hopefully the stream's alright. Tell me if you see, you experience any hiccups in the stream. Uh, we got some, some soccer. Oh, it actually works! Actually interactable. Okay, so I'm, I'm guessing I can't open any of these doors. Alright. Very, in a way, it's kind of unlike Fallout to give you almost access to everything. Like, it would be cool to go into the gym. And like see it. We've never seen a gym in Fallout, especially not in a good in good state. <laughs> yeah, it seems like everything is just It would be cool just to be able to get into these places. I don't know. Miss Sam. Hello. Oh finally. I feared you'd never wake up. Do you remember? It's reclamation day. Time to leave the vault. Most of the others have already gone. Get okay. What happens if I... Oh, there's no saving. Okay, no, I'm not... <laughs> this is not a normal Fallout game. I can't save and punch a friend and turn the entire vault against me and be okay. <laughs> Gotta remember. Stay fed, stay hydrated. Very important. Prevent... Oh, no, there's hydration... It's, oh, no. We were talking about this yesterday, how I didn't like having to keep myself fed. Oh, man. <laughs> first, first problem for me. I do not like. Yep, clunky survival mechanics. Yep. 
Oh, power is key. About the infrastructure out there in Appalachia, I suspect there isn't any. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. We'll see how annoying it gets. Hopefully not too much. I honestly hope it's not something... Oh. I do. Drunk, joyous, and not staving off horrible death minute by minute. <laughs> what do you miss? It has it has survival game mechanics like eating and drinking. You can get dehydrated. I just hope it's not all the time because I am not going to have a fun time if it is. If it's super naggy, then yeah, this is going to be the only time you see this game. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. Your camp is the key to survival and rebuilding, so use it often. Yeah, no, uh we'll see. <laughs> well that's a big that's a big no for me. That's a big no for me. <laughs> What's this? Black rim glass. Here, I'll take a pen. I'll take glasses. I'll take that. How do I level up in this game? Yeah, there we go. Uh, let's see. The, apparently these work very differently, so... It affects how much you can carry and the damage. Perceptions affects your near the nearby enemies, ability to detect stealthy movement, while weapon accuracy and vats. Endurance is me I feel like I'll rarely use vats just because of how they work in this game, but once again, that's something we're gonna test. Endurance is a measure of overall physical fitness, it affects your total health, action points drain from sprinting, resistance to disease. Charisma is your ability to lead and help others, it allows you to share higher point perks and also- Okay, so charisma, I remember reading this, because there is no like actual interaction with any other characters where you can talk and convince them, it's all about making- it's group perks, so this is probably something I won't be upgrading because I'm playing alone. Uh, intelligence, measure of all of your mental acuity, affects your robot, please, affects your ability to hack terminals, conditions, durability, your item craft, return to, uh, return you get from scrapping. Agility, uh, action points, in vats, and your ability to sneak, that's different, it's immediately attached to that, and luck. Effect recharge of critical hits, the durability of items. Ooh, durability of items, that's also a thing in this game. Fallout 4 had to remove that from the Fallout franchise. Ooh. Durability of items, hunger, and thirst. Alright. I'm gonna go with with this because I do not want to be over encumbered. Sure. Space accepts. Uh, final rating is 0 out of 10 because of survival. <laughs> I mean, hey. So I have one card and that's it. I have one thing for melee. Alright, robot. Oh. What's this? Level 2. Did I get a new pack? How do I how do I open the pack? I know it's like a pack of oh oh yeah there's a button for auto walking, <laughs> which I thought was pretty funny. Like oh oh yeah also I need it. Okay so always running it has a an always run button and I am keeping that activated. Uh, perks that's T. My perks unequip inspect share oh yeah I can give perks to others. Well all right. I want a gun. Eh. We'll see. We'll see. There there are quite a few negative gameplay not gameplay, uh mechanic mechanics negatives that um <laughs> I already have in mind. I still don't know how bad they're gonna be or how intrusive, but we know that they are there. I'm too, I'm too lazy to walk. Yeah, why is there a walk? Why is there a walk? Oh, I don't like that it's zoomed out like this. It's because of the FOV. 
But that sucks that it it zooms it out. It makes it hard for me to read it. Like in four, you could change the POV, but the it wouldn't change the POV of. Uh, can someone look it up if you can zoom into the terminals in Fallout 76? Because that's that's kind of annoying. That's so far, yeah, exactly. Uh, I'm not a, not a big fan of the distance here. Also, there are no... There we go, there's another one. Got it removed. Okay. Likeness zero. Does not end with S. Spend. Okay. Major. Nope. Viper. Viper. Shown. Nice. Okay. Security instructions. Vaults well, is one of the most highly valuable, important vaults in our network. As such, these orders must be obeyed at all costs. Upon receiving the activation notice, your team is authorized to use lethal force. Any obstacle or threat that stands between you and getting the vault residents safely inside the vault dealt with decisively. Okay. Uh, special instructions after the activation notice. As soon as the entry procedures are complete, your team must... So stow all weapons in the specified containers. Further orders will be dispensed. Trust your overseer. Obey your overseer. Know each other. Okay. Incident reports. Jill Kai. Okay, this is gonna be very like. You always want to open all of these in Fall Game in case it gives you like a, a marker or something. All right. <clears throat> so there is a weapons cache somewhere. Hey, go melee. I mean, that's what I have right now. Where's the weapons cache? I'm just going to try out generally the game. So I'm not going like, to go for a specific build immediately. I'm definitely going to... Probably the game as a whole out. Goodbye. No zooming as far as you can see onto the terminal to see it better. Well. Thank you for checking. It doesn't update the the picture we took. So like it still says I'm level one. <laughs> Well, okay, I was like, that looks horrible. It was just a, a visual glitch. <laughs> that looked terrible. It just looked like little blobs in the sky. <laughs> well, uh, we're out with our hunger meters and things. I think, yeah, I am actually going to lower the preset a little bit. I'm gonna leave it at what the preset was because the frame rate is dipping pretty harshly here. These games are known for having bad frame rate, so it is okay. Oh yeah, I need to restart the game. That's that's why I completely forgot. I need to restart the game. Uh okay. I will do that. How do I does it save? Is it like autosave? Desktop. I got money. I got currency to buy stuff. Melee will eventually be the best bet in terms of damage. Interesting. It does make me wonder like how, how rare ammo is going to be and stuff like that. 
again, don't tell me. I, I want to just feel it out, figure it out. I want to go into this game blind. So... And because there is there is story, but from what I heard, that's not really the focus of the game. Uh, even mechanical things that I will discover, stuff like that. I want to be able to discover it on my own. And we'll see how the how the save system works. I wonder what happens if you leave the game mid-fight. Oh no, wait, how do I... how do I change FOV? Okay, okay, it's a... okay. <laughs> okay. This is fine. Alright, yeah, the frame rate is a lot more consistent now. And that's the weird thing with, with uh, Fallout and this engine. It's not nearly at 100%. It never hits 100% uh, utilization on either CPU or GPU. But it lowers the frame rate. Oh, madam. I found this holotape on the overseer's terminal. Gave a little listen. Seems you should meet her at her camp, just down the road. Alright. I'll give it a little listen. The overseer said she'd set up her camp down the road to the south. Overseer's log. Or... Should I say, direct communication? Because whoever is listening to this had the moxie to try to find out where I've gone. But I'm glad you did. Truth is, I need your help. I've been given a task and... I've decided to break protocol and tell you what it is. Because if there's one thing I've learned in these past few years, it's that we need to rely on each other. There were three active nuclear silos in Appalachia before the bombs fell. They blew up the world before. Can't take their clothes? Can't let it happen again. So we've got to locate and secure all of the silos. Or die trying. Hopefully the former. But it's been 25 years. I just don't know what we're gonna find out there. Or where to start. My directive was to go to the nearest population center and assess the situation. I'll set up a camp on the way once I get my bearings. Find me there. Oh. Um, one thing that I, I do... What are you? What are you? Give me a second, give me a second, little buddies. I wanna I wanna look at you. Steel scrap. Liberator Mark Zero. Chinese? That's Chinese on there. Are these Chinese evil Chinese robots? <laughs> uh well, I'll say this much. Uh, when it comes to just like how Fallout looks and stuff like that, this looks good. <laughs> this looks good. Can't complain. Like, it, you're not gonna be getting here immediately. I, I can say this because this looks like Fallout. This looks like their engine, the creation engine. You're not gonna get anything insane looking, but the art style that they use tends to cover up well for any sort of issue. Hello. Um, I don't know if I, yeah, <laughs> gas container, cooking, yeah, the, the frame rate drops a lot. Uh, 
fox jerky, I guess. At least it doesn't take time to cook. Uh, leather left leg. Can sleep here. Beer bottle, I guess I'll, I'll take these. Purified water, disease cure. Rounds. No gun, though. Oh yeah, there's the whole instru instrument thing. Then you can play with your friends and I don't know what the point of it is, but... Uh... We shall see. Where am I going? Okay. But yeah. The, the game is constantly dipping down to 40s, uh, frame rate wise. It is capped at 60, like every uh, Bethesda game, because that's the cap of their of their engine. Uh, but it is constantly dropping to 40s and 30s. So, yeah, it does not seem to be. In that regard, the the most stable <laughs> game, and I'm I'm at this moment I'm comparing it to four, and four four had a did an all right job, uh, you know it had it had drops in like certain locations like uh, the Kaverga plant had uh, drops there, but can I hit a B? Mike. I'm, I was, I, I just hit, I killed bees with a machete. <laughs> I just killed, killed some bees with, with a machete. Combination wrench. What's this? Fire cap. I do wonder... My alert for me, whiskey. Uh, actually, give me one second. I do want to check... Uh, I do want to check what server I'm on and if I can choose that. Not like specific server, I know you can't choose that. But in the Bethesda app, if there is like a server choice that you have like a general idea of where it's being there does not seem to be okay so it just it just seems to be like a general general thing all right i was wondering if there was some sort of thing you could do is that it could be that the hiccups could be server related but i don't know But I have to say, it is it is kind of distracting. <laughs> Not enough to be like, oh man, this is this is the worst thing. I can't play it. But it is distracting. Isolated cabin. There's a bunch of dogs here. Rad X, dog meat, gunpowder, rib cage, and spine. Skull eye socket. <laughs> Stealth boy, really? <laughs> okay. Another thing I do wonder is if I am going to find anyone. Ooh, a safe. Like, you can't really sell stuff, so sh how much junk should I actually be picking up? 
is it important to pick up junk and stuff? Oh, hello, doggo. Wow, there, there are like hundreds of doggos here. Getting a lot of dog meat. What's the sound in the back, like running? Oh yeah, it's the dogs. It's the dogs. What's that? Let's say there's a message in there. But yeah, there were just a bunch of dogs running around the house. Ooh. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Again, I'll I'll be honest, I am considering small graphical glitches like this that don't affect the game as very trivial. I'm not going to be like, "Oh man." I'm considering these very tri trivial. But no, that they are there. <laughs> Fox hide. Uh you can't crouch? You can crouch. Uh, and that was what crouching looked like. Let's see what I... Everything gives you rad in this game, unlike Fallout 4 where if you cooked food, you weren't getting rad. Also, you need wood for everything. Which kinda sucks. But, see, so this is, this is crouching. Interesting, so they have an animation if you just spam it, but they have a, a longer animation if you do it slower. Okay. <laughs> One thing that I think they fixed, and it has continued here, is the density of, like, stuff, grass, and so on. I think that that feels and looks really good. I like when I, I'm looking in the distance like this and seeing a lot of grass. The, again, one thing that I was trying to say while we were looking at, at the intro video is that for a... For 25 years after nuclear bombs dropped, this looks awfully good. <laughs> there's a lot of plants, there's a lot of, you know, animals, there are people who did not go into the vault that survived somehow. Um, and that's honestly my, the biggest thing, like, I would love, I think it would be okay to have a game happen 25 years after the after the, the bombs drop, but it should have been a much more like destroyed desolate kind of location it's kind of how I kind of <laughs> would have imagined it would be like 25 years after nuclear bombs destroyed the country uh, Here, actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna switch the. Oh yeah, this game has no pausing, so I'm gonna switch how it's actually showing the game, so you guys can actually see the performance. There you go. It's gonna affect it a little bit, but you guys can see. So the target is 60. That's the target for this engine, and that I'm trying to reach right now. So keep that in mind while you. <gasps> There's a dude. There's a dude. Dude, 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 dude! No! Come back, Starpacker! Starpacker! <laughs> Aww. I, I, I want to say hi. You're literally the first person I meet. I thought I wouldn't meet anyone playing the game. Come back! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh. 
I'm back. All right, ha have fun. <laughs> I wonder what all the other emotes are. What, what is this? Team up? Oh, you can ask to team up. Okay. You can taunt. You can say no. You can be angry. You can be confused. You can be follow me. You can be miscellaneous. What's that? Oh. <laughs> Alright. Huh. <laughs> Well, I'm gonna head out. See ya. All right. Thank you for stopping the buy, Curl. I'm picking up uh, some fire caps and other items to make. Uh, to oh wow, he, he's talking to me. I got this. I got this. They fly! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh! He's just gonna watch me? Alright. Well... I've now watched like 10 seconds of Fallout 76. <laughs> I think I'm giving up. Well, da 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 da. -da. <laughs> oh, respawn. Where do I respawn? Can I respawn at the place I was? <laughs> I thought that was you could be stinky. Oh, so I can respawn right where I died. With all my equipment? What do I lose? Is it just the junk? So there is no real punishment for dying. Okay. Here's all my stuff. Alright. Propag... Ganda flyer. Re rebuilding the future for a broken nation. Okay. Yeah, there doesn't. Steel scrap. Alright. And can I go into this place? How fallout is this? Also, a welcome, Abram. <laughs> welcome, welcome. <gasps> a gun! <laughs> Tinker, Tinkerer's workbench. This is no. Let's see what you've got been saying. Uh, was that enough, or should I persevere? <laughs> Thought that was... You could be sinky. Persevere. Oh, wait, wait, Erica. I have to prepare for it. <laughs> Need to clean my apartment. Prepare for what? Okay, so you can bulk aluminum. All right. But this is how you're probably going to be doing most of your things. Okay, so my guess on why it's... Why, um... Why the frame rates are dropping so much is because I, I am in American servers. And I'm not in America anymore. So it's probably trying to make me... It's giving me high ping, therefore lowering the frame rate constantly. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to pause it real quick. I'm going to go change that. I'll see if I can change, if I have to go into my account to change the location. Too bad you can't just change the server you're in. Uh, but I'll change my location. See if I get better ping, better uh, server response. Uh, you guys will be will get to look at me. 
my beautiful face in this black background. It's not a black background. Uh oh, oh. Oh no. I in case there's like passwords or, or anything or my address. <laughs> well, good thing I I did the thing. <laughs> Uh Okay, account has been updated. I'm gonna I'm actually gonna quick Bethesda launcher and relaunch it, make sure it's clean. Oh, it's okay. Rod's bot. What? Look at that face. What? Oh. <laughs> Walks to your address. I assume it will take a while. It may involve swimming quite a while. <laughs> hey, swimming is fun. TM. Here, I'll, I'll turn it back on now. This is honestly a game I never thought I'd be playing. So. <laughs> you did forget to say bot, and bot is not live right now. So I'm actually going to do that. I'm going to turn on. See, that's all I have to do. That is all I have to do. I have to click bot, and that's it. Let's see if uh, frame rate became more consistent. If it's not trying to just throw me into a, a North American server. <laughs> then why do you forget? I don't know. I don't know. Alright, bot is online. Bot is online if you ever want to use. So if you want to hug people, if you want to know what my friend code for the Switch is, go ahead and... oh, thank you for the hug. But yeah, we'll see if there, there's any difference in switching the country on my account. I hope there is. I really hope it's just because I was on, like, a server on the opposite side of the world that I was getting terrible, terrible frame rate. Um... Yeah, we'll, we'll see. Erica, I think you might be here alone now. <laughs> Just you and me, Erica. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> the game gave off. <laughs> He's like, nope. <laughs> Did I not get my stuff back? I did get all my stuff back. It just put me... Nope, frame rate is not better. It's actually worse. Yeah, the frame rate is actually worse. It is actually worse. <laughs> oh boy, okay. <laughs> come here, come here! <laughs> that bitch just folded in half the wrong way. <laughs> Thank you, Ragdoll. Thank you, Ragdoll. Yeah, it's not good. Wow, these guys have really good aim. So it seems like the moment there is literally anyone on screen, 
it slows down. <laughs> Which is not good. <laughs> it is not good. Bobby Pinbox. Alright. And again, I am taking into consideration that... Uh, oh. Oh. I am taking into consideration that the condition that my PC is in right now. So, I do know that it is weaker, but I, I did specifically low the, lower the settings of the game for, for that reason. And it seems like in the vault it was doing a, a fine job. But then again, you could consider that the vault is a lot more limited. So... Uh, let's see guns. How do I put them in... Favorites C, okay. So I have... I can't use it, it's a level 5. I can't use... Can I... fix? No, wait. Does fixing work the same way? Thirty-four. I don't have too much ammo. I'm gonna save it a little bit. Although I can craft ammo. It does let me craft ammo, but I don't think it's ammo for any of the guns I have. So, oh wait, there's more. What's the more? Railway spikes. Okay, I'm just not gonna do it right now. Enamel bucket. What? Duct tape. Okay. Used oil can. Okay, where am I trying to go? Alright, I was going the wrong way. But yeah, it seems to drop the moment you get into combat, which is, I think... The worst time a game can drop frames, because that's when you need the frames the most, when you're paying attention. Also, I'm seeing my water meter, and it's halfway down. <laughs> so, we'll see, we'll see. Staying positive, staying positive. Seems like I'm going to whatever that house is. Ooh. Hitch, 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 hitch. Oh, no. Oh, wait. Okay. I knew this wasn't going to be the Appalachia I remembered, but... Mutated animals? Haywire bots? No people so far. We have to be ready... <laughs> no people so far. She is not happy about but that. I can confirm it. Hostile territory. Fortunately, Vault Tech was prepared. You see this? The cooking station? The stash box, the workbenches, all built with the camp. You need a home base out there. The construction and assembly mobile platform is designed to give you one. Just add resources, planning, and a little elbow grease. When you move your camp, everything you've built is stored, ready to be placed back down in the new area. Use this to establish a foothold whenever you're in... Why am I on caution? I've left my camp behind so you can use it. I know I'm breaking my own advice by not taking it with me. But after seeing Appalachia for myself, I need to make sure every resident of 76 has a safe haven they can start from. I'll make do without it. She has literally broke ev Still broken every single rule. The town of Flatwoods is further down this road. Find me there. This is the overseer. Signing off. It seems like, yeah, you... She's literally broken all of the rules that she set. I think that's pretty funny. Uh, actually, I, I, I believe I have... Apparel. 
Yeah, I have leg apparel. Keep pressing escape, too. Oh, this is how I repair. So I can craft and repair blunt melee weapons, edged melee weapons, pipe guns, throwing knife. Okay. So if I, I press space, I get to edit or modify my weapons that I currently have. Can I... T repair. Okay, so you don't combine weapons like you did before. You're not combining we weapons, which I actually thought was a good idea. You combine the weapons. It was easy, it was simple, you didn't have to get specific components. Here they're they're making it a lot a lot more complicated by making you get Way more components. Uh, I'm gonna scrap this. Because I have a better one. Uh, and also, it seems like you, you learned a recipe when you scrap something. Uh, oh no, look at my head. Also, just been disconnected. Alright. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> I'll say this, just based on the game itself, it's not giving me a very good impression. Performance hasn't been the best. The servers, even though it's been months since the game release, have not been too solid. Uh, other than that, it does feel like a Fallout game. It feels like a normal Fallout game. Okay, so I did lose progress on what I was doing. I'm not messing with anything else. Now I don't have enough wood, either, which I had before. Combat knife. Okay. I can... I'm also not wearing the armor I was wearing. Uh... Repair. Right. But, um, but yeah, so far that's also. Yeah. How do I? Okay, I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I hate that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, oh wow, there's hair physics. There are hair physics. Hair physics in this game. That's. I don't think the other Fallout games had hair physics. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I hate that. It's, it's really derpy. I, I'm not gonna lie. It is very derpy. <laughs> Where do I get wood? Is this Minecraft? Can I get wood from doing this? I shouldn't be doing that. My, my weapons. What happens if I sleep? Do I get health? Is this like a normal game? Do I get health if I sleep? Oh yeah, this is real time. Um, oh, I, I do get health. Bed slowly heals you, being enough to gain a bonus, but worn mattresses lying on the ground can carry disease. Uh... <sighs> Out of everything in this game, I hate the hat. Trees. Uh, yeah, my brain went completely in the wrong direction from that question. 
Oh. <laughs> Get up, you're gonna die. I got I gotta refill my health. This is boring. This is a terrible mechanic. Actually having real time sleeping. <laughs> it's a free way to do it, but like you're 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 just sitting here waiting for your life to come back. It's not a it's not a very fun mechanic. Here's how I would fix this. It would heal faster, but you have a lot of, like, vulnerability. Because what makes it interesting in a survival game when you have to sleep uh, is the fact that, you know, you, you become vulnerable to anything attacking you. So what I would do is make the animation to lie down and get up very slow, and you can't get out of that animation. So... If it's not a viable thing for you to do during battle, oh, uh, sure. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna join this guy. Let's see, let's see what this is like. Uh, I don't, <laughs> can, can I, can he be team leader? I don't know, I don't know how this works. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a level, level two here. Is that a new dude? It's a new, clearly it's, it's some sort of dude that's played the game a lot because he has, he has quite a bit of, also, has quite a bit of experience. Place your own camp. Uh, I don't, I don't, dude, can can I? I kind of feel bad because I I'm I'm kind of gonna be like. Wait, wait. I have no clue what I'm doing. Team. Uh, promote to leader. There we go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you do, do your thing. Oh, oh, dude, dude, he's so nice. That guy's so nice. Thank you! Oh man! Dude! That's so sweet! <laughs> guy's so sweet! Thank you so much! Thank you so much! <laughs> so, what do you want to do? I'm, I'm like open. I, I honestly have... I don't really have anything I, I, I kind of want or need to do. I, I don't I can't talk to the guy. Um... Yeah, that, that was super sweet. Uh... Boiled carrot... I drink? Where's my water? Where's my purified water? Oh, here it is. Is he gone? He is! He just stopped by to give me stuff, and now he's gone. That's so sweet. That was really sweet. <laughs> Wait, no, where is he? He's still he's still on my team. Where did he go? <laughs> okay, this this is the worst menu. Oh, 
up. We got a bad guy on the on the server. Oh, he just he just got out of there. I'm going to his camp. Let's let's check this out. Cuz yeah, I guess we're still teamed up together, so we'll see. We'll see where he takes us. We'll see what what he does. This guy has an insane base. <laughs> um what is this? Oh. Wow, this guy whoa. <laughs> this is pretty cool. <laughs> what's up? What's up? I I don't know what to do. It looks so cool. There's so much stuff here. <laughs> Um, let's see, let's see. I have... Did he give me ammo? He did not give me ammo, but I'm not complaining. I'm genuinely not complaining. Aha, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna use that. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, I'll follow, I'll follow. Okay, no wait, that, that's the wrong thing. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, a short, short assault rifle. It's level 50. I can't use it. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, wait, wait. I, I, I don't know how to... Yeah, I can't use it. It's too bad. I have, I have this. I'm gonna I'm gonna follow this dude. Wow, this is a very different looking area. Can can you just climb? Whoa! <laughs> this is weird. What? What? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Oh wow, if I jump, it uses my... my stamina. Okay, okay, okay. There's something here. Canned dog food. Baseball base. Oh, oh, what do you have here? Glowing meat? Guess I'll take that. Ant meat, combination rare, gunpowder, scalpel. Yeah, this guy's just taking me around and showing me awesome stuff. I mean, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna complain. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, 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 okay. Glowing meat. Okay, cool, cool, cool. He has a grand. You need a suit. <laughs> Oof. The... The frame rate. This looks nice. I like the depth, how it, it's, it gets foggy in the background. I do like that. I'll be honest. Oh! Oh, they're, they're, they're the big boys. This gun sucks. I have to reload every time. Pre-war money. Oh, it takes so long for them to... My alert meat. My alert meat. What are you?! 
Meyer Lurk Deep King? Oh, that's terrifying. <laughs> He's just getting a bunch of eggs. I, uh, I think I should use my... How do we put it in the favorites? Oh, I have a level up. Give me a second. I... I'm gonna keep leveling up my strength. Weight of all cams has been reduced. Nice. Space, except. Uh... Okay, okay, where is he, where is he? Okay. I feel like this, I'm actually gonna get to see a little bit more of the game because he has travel points and stuff like that. So it's actually going to give me a little bit more variety with the stuff I get get to see by playing with this guy. Plus, he's been super nice, so I'm not going to complain. He just gave us like a level 50 weapon and level 50 stuff, which I can't, I won't be able to use for a long time. I'm not even sure if I'll ever be able to use it, but also, how do I put things on my favorites? C. C is favorite. I'm gonna put that, that, and that, and that. Okay. Oh, we're doing we're doing a mission. I'm get I'm getting some of Overseer's log. Make a cherry. Cigar. Sam He's trying to turn me into a smoker. He's evil. Those damn traitors and their secessionists turned their backs on America to form their free states. Concrete bunkers. You'd never get that past a vault tech radiation proofing inspection. That's for sure. Sounds like they let go of their paranoia long enough to seek out help from the other survivors. Just have to hack this terminal. See what they left behind in there. Bell? And what they wanted to do. Heard. Remote door control. Open door. Hey. There we go. Boiled water. Ooh, the lighting is kind of rough in here. It's way too bright. It's way too bright. I have to go. I'll talk to you later. All right. Thank you so much for stopping by, Erica. But yeah, I, I feel like they're... Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. I feel like... The most I have to say is the fact fact that it feels like a Fallout game at this point where they try to attach survival and online. Wait, is he is he on the other side of the door now? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, what happened? What? What happened? <laughs> He's a monster. <laughs> Why? No! No! Oh! Can I, can I, uh, uh, can I take a picture? Can I take a picture with you? 
Continue playing. Yeah, they want me to pay. Get out of here. Photo mode. Unavailable. Ah, screw you, man. I want to take a picture with this guy. Oh, whoops. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Uh, can I, can I, can I get a selfie? Player on, pose category. Oh, I can't. That's too bad. <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> can you hear me? Oh, I, I can hear him. I can, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, how do I, how do I get, get out of there? Uh, yes, yes, I, I can hear you. I can hear you. <laughs> look, I know, look at his hands. It's terrifying. Is there ch text chat? Here, let me... Text chat. Let's see. Game. Oh no, it's showing my email. <laughs> okay. All right. Thank you, Bethesda. Are uh, Are you coming? Uh. Yeah. Yeah. I'm ready. I'm ready. Where are you? Wait, where did he go? He's right here. Is he inside? Did the game just glitch out? I think I think there there might be a problem here. <laughs> where did he go? I think the game is broken. I'm gonna have to exit. I need to restart it. Quit to desktop. Man, <laughs> that's some that's some weird bug. <laughs> that character model is making me uncomfortable. That's a bug. That's a bug right there. <laughs> wow. Wow. Yeah, he was, he was saying, are, are you coming? It sounded like he was moving around, but he wasn't. He wasn't in my game, so. I think there was a bug where he was just stuck in a deformed mode, so. Play with team. That was interesting. Well, you, you can really see. Also, to be fair, I own like two, three follow games that have played less time in them than watching you in this. I'm a bad person, I guess. Well, know this. Fallout 4 is, I think, mechanically more approachable than others, but when it comes to story and game overall, I think it's the worst of them. Fallout New Vegas is the best RPG. And it Weapon... Oh, it just crashed. Weapons and stuff like that are very inaccurate, but I like that. Because the it actually means that the more you improve, the better you actually will be at shooting, even if you are a great FPS player. So, in the beginning, it, there will be a lot of sway and stuff like that. I, I genuinely enjoy that. It's, a, it's more of an RPG than an action game, where 4 be, turned Fallout more into a, an action game. That was the one I actually did buy all the DLC for. For New Vegas. I personally recommend New Vegas. I think overall, that one is the best one of the modern ones. 
New Vegas. Yeah, definitely play that. Uh, it's not the most stable game. I would recommend... I don't know how much you've delved into mods and stuff. I would recommend all the bug-fixing mods that they have on the Nexus. Um... Because that helped me a lot. Help helped me stabilize the game, make it perform a little bit better. Uh, I would genuinely recommend getting those. But, oh, please tell me the game didn't, like, permanently break. Okay. Okay. Let's head back to Flatwoods. I'll fast travel there and you can follow me. Alright, alright. That way you don't have to spend any caps. Okay, he's fast traveling, I'm gonna follow him. Where did he go? Custom destination. But yeah, so that that's honestly what I would recommend. Uh, mouse sensitivity was effed as hell. It's really high. But honestly, I, I have not had a problem with any of the games that I remember. Also, I have played a lot of them with mods already. So, I am not sure. I'll be completely... Wait a minute. Also, why can't I go into first person? Okay. I've made it to Flatwoods if you want to fast travel to me. Alright, we're gonna fast travel and fast trap. There we go. Uh, FOV was also weird, that's something this game was the first game to actually give it an FOV slider. None of the other games have an FOV slider. So uh, I found that to be a really big problem. Uh, by the way, I... I don't think he can hear me, because I don't have a microphone on, but... Yeah, I see him. But... F... Uh, frame rate is rough here. Automated warning to all responders. Mr. Phone hands are out of control. Evacuate civilians, and take down those supervisors. Once they're dealt with, you'll have to reboot the server. Again. Yeah, performance is rough in this game. Honestly, it might be something that... Truth to responders, volunteers, and eh. there. On what? Whatever happened here is beyond anything we expected. And we expected a lot. But yeah, I wonder how much streaming is actually the survivors hey, call themselves volunteer. If you need Looks supplies, like they made of firefighters, police, got you covered. emergency medical staff. So th he, there are vendors. About treating water, food, survival. I'm doing their tests, and you should too. I know that it's even overseer lady said more. Someone's got people to know where the missile silos are coming, and how to it's secure them. Nice the responders are the you. best lead we have. This is the overseer signing off. All right. I guess I can sell the junk. While you're over here, why not grab a stem back or two? All 
Alright, that gave me 27. Alright. <laughs> Give me 27. Uh, ammo. I... Weapons that I can use. All oh, these weapons suck, by the way. Piper of... The pistol is not very good, but it is a 308. Okay, I have a lot of 308 weapons, so I'm gonna I'm gonna buy some three. Oh, they don't have 308 ammo. Uh, what was it's 308? This is 0.45. All right, they do have 0.45, so I'm gonna buy some 40. Nope, that's 200 caps. All right, whatever. I don't care. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you grab the meds out of the first aid kit. Oh, it's loading. It's, it's it's taking me a while. Wait, where's the first aid kit? Oh, okay. Oh, and then. This. One other thing in here, I forgot. This guy's just super nice. He's just giving me stuff. I can hear you. Oh. But yeah, they, they did fix... There, uh, there wasn't anything there. But did he put anything there? I, I didn't see... I didn't see anything here. What? Okay. Whatever. Whatever. Alright, let's go. But... Is that what we were looking at? I'm just gonna kind of explore, I guess, while we're here. But yeah, they they did fix mechanically a lot of stuff, but you do still need a good amount of mods to make, you know, the modern day conveniences of video games. Ooh, a pipe revolver. I I can use that. Like a lot of things you you probably take for granted uh, is something that. The games, uh, the Fallout games, still do not give you. Um, all right, I have a pipe revolver. Wait, how do I do that? Oh, yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready. What are What are we doing? Where are we going? Oh, oh, oh. I... He's giving me so many things, I can't, I can't use them. <laughs> the guy's giving me so much stuff. Give me ammo for this. I know it's not a, an F, FPS, but I want all those things, all the settings, or it makes me crazy. I know, I agree, this, that's... One of the big negatives with, with Bethesda games is that they... Grab the holotape off the dead body on the ground. Wait, where? where, where? Oh, oh. Yeah. okay, okay, okay. Listen to it and then uh, stories for stand in the water, you know, collect one dirty water. Like a fine idea. So, hi, I am Kesha McDermott. When the bombs fell, I was in Watoka coordinating a statewide science fair for that year's high school kids. And the theme was the future of energy. After the bombs, everything was pretty chaotic. Scavenging for food and fighting off rabid survivors. Oh, it was just a bad time all around. I found a couple of surviving kids from the high school whose parents didn't make it. Oh. The house in town for a while. After the impact, I was able to solder the circuitry in an old radio and be tuned in to a broadcast from the responders. Man. Oh, we were over the guns I have point. suck. <laughs> Group of assholes in the mountains who stole 
all our food and water. Come this way. I can't tell you how happy I was to find the responders in Flatwoods. Okay. Tense Wait, how do I? No, this is. Okay. Wait. Man, the, this is a lot of exposition. This is a lot of exposition in this holiday. I stepped up and I said, I'll build a testing kit to monitor the contamination and I will teach folks how to properly boil water. And I did. You could have just said, I have a thing to boil water. This, oh, she's still going. <laughs> Oh, I'm thirsty. Well, oh no, I'm not thirsty. I'd like the dirty water out of the pump. <clears throat> Wait, it's collect, not drink. One. Wait, did I collect it? We head back this way towards the church. I think, I think I, I think I, I collected. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> that that sounds like a very menial task. Go there, collect water, and come back. Oh, Brahmin! Shoot the cow. Shoot the cow! Take the meat. Wow, we just killed a Brahmin. This dude has no heart. <laughs> can't I can't be seen walking around with this guy. Okay, yeah, I guess we're going back to the church. But yeah, it's uh where's shotgun here? Yeah, it's a single shot rifle. It's a single shot rifle. Man, honestly, like I wish I wish the performance was a little bit better. Oh, there's another dude. Come up here. And use the diagnostic yeah. terminal. Access denied. Uh interview with another survivor, Kesha McDermott. She found me trying to break into a Nuka-Cola machine and um, showed me a different way. Okay. I don't... I don't think it's working. terminal over here. Yeah, I have no clue. This turn? Oh, yeah, I do have a marker here. Now. I forget what it is. Dilbert or something. Oh, oh. That's a big list. <laughs> right. oh, we completed a quest. Okay. I guess we we got water for someone. Item reward. Whoa, whoa. Become a volunteer responder. Complete basic training course. Okay. Take a right and get that recipe off of right here. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Delbert Sunshine Oil. Oh, so it seems like it's a lot of like grabbing recipes and not doing. That's the thing. The I loved exploring and follow, but it was backed by fun. Take the thing off of this guy, the hollow tape, and then use this terminal. Reverend Delbert Winters here, born and raised in this very town. To training. In my own church to the responders for their outpost here. Responders are on a true mission, you see. Helping folks through thick and thin. Till the hey. heavens open up again and take us all up anyways. When this all happened, I figured like most it was time. This was the end. Okay. But, but it wasn't, was it? 
We're still here. Get some meat from the one of the local cows, toss it in the fire until it stops losing. Okay. But yeah, it, I don't know. It seems like the gameplay loop isn't. All right, collect wood right here. I'm ready to fight them up there by your side. Over over here. Cook the brown steak. Yeah. So he actually, he's just giving me like a, I guess a, a quick. All right, I don't have wood. I, I, I forgot I need any polyuretic coins left too. Then I would be in test. Then on, okay. I built kitchens, cook good food. Fed mm, anyone who walked up. Where's the Brahmin? And I was thankful for my task in life. Ribeye, ribeye steak. Yeah. If you want to grab this stuff in the bag. Next time, hell or high water land in my bag. I'll be swept clear away with it. Yeah, he kind of just. Alright, uh, I'm gonna take you to Fort McClintic so that you can get your uh, water purifier. Look southeast of here, South. or just simply go to the social tab and fast travel to me. Alright, yeah, okay. I wish, I wish there was, there was a better way to communicate. I mean, I can turn on voice, but I, I really don't like turning on voice. I really don't. So it's like, uh, yeah. past travel. But yeah, it feels like it's almost there mechanically, in the sense that like it has so many of the things that I enjoy about Fallout, but. Feels off. Which is which is too bad. Yeah, I can level up. Uh, yeah, let's open the perk pack. Gun runner. I'm suing the fire department. They ruined my surprise dinner. Okay. I don't get it. Mm. Falling below 20%. Running speed is increased by 10% when you have a pistol equipped. I like that. Interesting. You know you want to join the army. Come on. But yeah. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna feel kind of bad, but I'm actually... I'm actually gonna... You're gonna find your industrial purifier. What's it? What's it called? I'm gonna... Make sure that you go into your pit boy and uh your notes. I'm not gonna be an asshole. I'm, I'm gonna give him I'm gonna give him his his like big gun back. I'm actually just gonna go on my own. I wanna I wanna figure this out alone. It'd been cool, but I just feel like I'm just at this point like he really wants to help me, but I I'm just doing things. I kinda wanna go exploring and do other stuff, but yeah. Uh, I'm actually... I do... Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna... Let's see. Where is he? Where is he? Uh, I'm gonna do a goodbye. How do I... Alright, yeah, and, because, 
I do want to do this at a at a different pace. So how do I how do I leave team? Leave team. And leave world? What happens if I leave world? Can I choose the world I'm in? The problem with fall I had with Fallout, the first person ones anyhow, was the same problem I had with Skyrim. I don't want to manage inventory by throwing shit on the ground. That is fair. I mean, if you're not into that, the, these are definitely not your, <laughs> your games. These are very much like looter RPGs. That's how they're made. That's how they're... That's kind of like the point of oh, the store. Let's see what kind of crap they have in the store. This, this stuff is expensive. Um, we can have different Pip-Boy colors, gray paint. But yeah, it's... That's pretty cool hair. <laughs> um, it is very much the style of the game, and there, there is no, like... Yeah, if you're, if you're not into that, I think that that's a core part of Bethesda games, and it's really not going to work out very much. Like, especially if you go with 4, and this game, they very much rely a lot more on looting because it has building and stuff like that. So I would say that definitely would be a weaker... A weaker thing. A weaker game for the the type of play you want to have. Um, I'm gonna play. It's probably gonna gonna put me back where I was, but and I think that honestly, you you should give a, give New Vegas a try. It looks very dated. There's a lot of very clunky mechanics. Uh, but I think one thing that they nailed, but because it's Obsidian, if, I mean, if you like Obsidian games, uh, there will be a narrative to enjoy there. And there, there are other mechanics like... Okay, where am I? Right. There are other mechanics like uh where am i okay hell fast travel there I just need to check the mods as you mentioned i did too much manual editing for me to want to do that but if there are mods already, yeah, no, I, I recommend with New Vegas a lot of, a lot of mods already. Already have like. Uh, what do they want me to do? Now I feel like it's all kind of screwed because, I. I now have like missions from like that, that have nothing to do with what I'm doing. You know what, since it's kind of the nature of this right now is for me to just really is just to try the game for what it is, I'm just going to restart the game. Because I think on my own I literally did nothing. I can just run and get to the same spot I was. Do I, do I delete a character? Also, one thing that I'm wondering about the frame rate and the server issues, it seems like it puts you in the same level, in the same world every time. So because I was already attached to a server in North America, it was always gonna put me there. But now that I have reset it and I'm starting a new level, it is possible that that's gonna be fixed.
So that's the hope. We'll see. But yeah. I one thing I really like to do, Avram, is mod uh, mod streams. I love mod streams. So maybe one day, one of these days, I might do it like a a quick mod stream, just showing off some some good uh, new Vegas mods. Okay, can I can I skip this? Yes, I can. Good morning, Vault Seventy Six. I'm not a mod. Yet? Question mark. Welp. <laughs> okay. I mean, while we're here, I might as well show you some of the the mods I have saved. Nexus Nexus mods. So one thing you will want to do is download download uh, Nexus Mod Manager, which oh, do they have a new app? Elegant, powerful. They changed. Wow, I am old now. <laughs> I am old. Vortex. What is this? Okay, okay. I guess we're we're discovering here something new. Uh, what's the bot bot telling me? All right. We'll see. And I'm curious. Now, I'm kind of curious about this. I'll be coming back to 76 in a little bit, but for now, I'm going to change to just chatting. Uh, no, that's not what I want to do. I want to go to the dashboard. Yes. Because now I'm curious about this. <laughs> but yeah, I'm signed in. So let me open up New Vegas. They go to New Vegas, they're hot mods. The easiest way to find good mods is going to top files. Boom, you just go there and you get all the top files. Most usually it is. Anti-crash, this is important. <laughs> this is one of the big ones. Texture pack, this actually makes it look a lot better. Mod configuration, you can use that. This one is a plugin. Script extension of the script extender. I remember I used it. Adds 800 plus new functions when used in GEC scripting. Yeah, this is important so you get more compatibility with mods and stuff. Stutter remover is important. Uh, four gigabyte patcher because by default the engine only uses two gigabytes of memory. So this allows it to increase up to four. An official patch to this one's very good as well. So yeah, you can just go here and get the the top ones, and you'll you'll be pretty good. It won't change the game, but we'll make it either look better with texture mods, or you know. Let's see a comparison here. But yeah, if you if you ever look at the game vanilla, it, it I mean it's an old game. It's been t almost ten years now. But yeah, it does allow it to look a lot sharper and nicer. I mean, this is a texture mod. You know, you know what you're gonna get here. It's just sharper looks, sharper visuals. Um, I did want to compare. I love comparison screenshots. <laughs> Give me a comparison screenshot. Yeah, we're going really far back here. Does he not have any comparison screenshots? All right, I'm done. I'm done. Anyway, this is a good, this is a good, uh, let's check out Vortex. This is, I haven't modded in a while. <laughs> this is, uh, I wonder what they've changed, if there's anything new. So it's not Nexus Mod Manager anymore. Okay, register or log in. Uh, I will log in. 
Authorize. Boom. All right. Downloads, games, manage, discovered, supported. Uh, ooh, New Vegas. I, I want this. Okay, so it's not. Handle. We'll now handle Nexus download links. Nice. Dismiss. Okay, so you still continue looking them on the website, but it automatically downloads it. Nice. So I think I can uninstall Nexus Mod Manager, which I guess I'll do just so there isn't any conflict between both of them. Uh, hey, you're looking at all my apps. Uh... I love how many Visual C++ stuff Windows adds on yours, on your thing. <laughs> yeah, uninstall. Yep. 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 Okay. So I did have a list of the mods. Tracking center. So you can track all, a bunch of mods, and I have a bunch of them tracked. <clears throat> so what do we have here? This is. Can I get just Fallout New Vegas? See, LOD texture patch. So. You know how LODs work. <laughs> it makes it so... With that NMC patch, that texture patch, it... It makes it look way better in the distance. It fixes it. Fixes the... Anyway. So the, there's like fixes for mods. But this is pretty much all I kind of put on mine. It was very simple. Uh, don't use this one. But the ones I would recommend... Actually, don't use this one either. This changes the game a lot and in many ways makes it better, but it introduces a bunch of bugs and stuff. But this changes the game a lot. Like, it adds a lot more detail, makes people look less potato-y. You'll see, like, it, there, there's a lot of improvement. So, like, this is the original game. This is... It just it just makes them look a little bit better. Anyway. But yeah, it doesn't really matter. And it, it makes a lot of weird things happen, so I wouldn't recommend it. Uh okay, so I can close this. So I would recommend the LOD patch. Uh character overhaul it doesn't you don't really need this. Effect textures enhanced. Uh, Anti-crash, enhanced shaders. This this one just makes the game look nice. I like this one. Although if you do want the more, you know, vanilla feel, you definitely just don't put any of these. Honestly, if you if, if you want to keep the original feel, want to keep the original game as close as possible to what it is. I would, I would genuinely just recommend these top files. I would recommend New Vegas, Anti, Anti Crash, Texture Pack. You don't really, really need that. Uh, but actually, before you do any of these, uh, I do believe there's one thing you have to do, and it's install N NF. Uh, what, what's it called? It's the script extender for the game. So you, you go, you just look for New Vegas Script Extender. NVSC is the name. Boom, right there. It's the first one. You go here, download stable version. You download that, downloads it. And you put it in your, your uh, what's it called? The game files. You put it in the game files and installation. Copy the DLL and EXE files to the Fallout New Vegas directory. This will allow, this is a script extender, allows it to run, you know, different scripts that the original game would not usually allow. So then that allows all these mods to work. Uh, Fallout New Vegas. Okay, there's one more modding Fallout New Vegas. 
There was one more thing. Modding help for beginners. Uh... Is this... There is one more instruction. Script extender... It's been a while since I've... But there's something you have to change in the... Maybe not, maybe... Documentation... I think Nexus mod had forums, yeah. And I want to find this because I believe that there is one file that you need to change. Fallout New Vegas. Gek extender. Maybe not. Maybe it's only in four that you need to do specific things. Either way, I, I, I don't think it applies for this game then. But yeah, so... Da -da, tap files. I don't even know if you're still there. But, yeah. This one. This one. This one. This one. This one. That's it. No real need to install anything else. Even this one is a little bit superfluous. You don't need it. It is nice to have, though. Um, so yeah, just that. Anti-crash, texture pack, the plugin for NVSC. St oh yeah, stutter remover, and this. But before you do any of this, NVSC, New Vegas Script Extender. And that's it. And you download it, it's really simple. I'll just demonstrate it here real quick. Uh, da -da -da, Vortex, you click Vortex when you download that. It's gonna show up on Vortex, downloads. Fallout New Vegas. Yeah, it's gonna require the game. But yeah, it downloads it, you install it. It's really simple with these apps. It's usually just a click. You click it and that's it. Um and you and you'll you'll be good. You will be good. <laughs> but yeah, what time is it? It's four o'clock. You may have to send me this. I haven't been paying <laughs> close enough attention. But it's on Nexus, and I think I shouldn't have a problem. Yeah, except for the NVSC, which is the script extender, which allows all these these mods to work. Uh, but yeah, I'll definitely send all this to you. Yeah, it's pretty simple, so it won't be it won't be too hard to follow. Settings. Yeah, it just makes the game more stable, which is, it's necessary. It is necessary. I don't know how to delete a character. Thank you so much, Avram. Thank you very much for the bits. Thousand bits, that's a lot of bits. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> because it didn't a Valentine's anyway. Thank you so much. <laughs> didn't have a Valentine's.
But yeah. I love modding games. Uh, to me, it's so fun. I like building computers. I like modding games. To me, it's something that they both have in common, that it's the tinkering with smaller stuff. Obviously, if you're just going to do simple modding, you don't have to like tinker with files and stuff, but I absolutely love doing that. And... I don't know, that's why I honestly think that I would love job a job like uh, building computers or IT or something like that, because it is something... I can't delete this character! I want to delete it! I want to delete this character! I want to go into a, a server that's near me, but the game doesn't let me. <laughs> Can I just change my appearance on the fly? Wow. Okay. Wow, she looks sick. <laughs> She also looks like Charlize Theron. She looks like Charlize Theron. <laughs> if you give her, uh, give her a Furiosa hair. No, her her forehead's wait. Her head's too big. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, <laughs> if you want a want a pseudo gay boyfriend, I'm on board. Don't tell my wife. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> she shows up in the middle of the stream. What are you doing, Avram? I'm guessing that that's your name. Your legal name is Avram. I mean, touch my box in a way. What do I keep in that box? This is my secret. I can mute myself. Okay. Ram! My box of ram. I mean, honestly, speaking of ram, that's what I'll probably be using the bits for. Buying ram, which is what this computer lacks. <laughs> it lacks ram. Uh, I keep opening my email. People are gonna know my email and... Back to main menu. I don't know how to delete a character. Delete a character Fallout 76. Delete, select delete. Select Fallout 76. Place ticks next to Fallout 6 save data. What? The leading character, Fallout 76. Never paid attention during the beta. Yes, you can. It's in the menu under characters. At the main menu, there should be a characters menu open there. You can delete your character. Oh yeah, I forgot. Delete R. Really? I'm just... And the character's name. Really? Okay. Wait. People use Windows tab often? I almost never do. Yeah, I mean, that's just Alt-Tab, right? I don't know. I've always just used alt tab. That's that's what it is for me. That's my alt tab. No, not the same. What happens if I use Whoa? That's what happens if I press window tab. Windows tab. This is alt tab. This is Windows tab. I don't like this. I don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> I did not like that oh, experience, <laughs> even though I only had it for half a second. I hope th they put me in Bra in Brazilian servers right now. I. Good morning, Vault Seventy Six. Uh oh, the game is kind of bugged. It immediately put me. This is the overseer. What face did I go with? I think I went with face four. I hope you all enjoyed the party last night. I, I'm just gonna do the same thing. 
Yeah. It's a cute face. I don't think you could do this before. Today is reclamation day. Yeah, I like maybe time to leave, but I'll never They did add a lot more variation. I like this face. You come from every walk of life, every race, color, and creed. But you all share one very important trait. Sure. You know what? You are this country's best and brightest. But more importantly, you'll always be my family. Hell yeah. I like that you can change it whenever, so I can actually just have whatever hairstyle and then switch it when I get bored of it. Why is this the standard body, you know? This is what we like. Alright. I like leaving it right in the middle. Maybe like right there. Like the body starts getting really deformed looking. I guess that's why it's on the thinner side, because it looks kind of weird. E. Don't have any incriminating programs open. Hmm. Preference, I'll send you a WinTab image, assuming I don't... Uh. <laughs> oh, I see. I see what you were saying before. This will always be default hero Sam. I don't... Feel the view. I like blurry backgrounds. I like the expressions. Let's go the other way around. Tired. Thinking. Sinister smile. I do like peaceful. I like the sleeping person. <laughs> I like the sleeping person pose. I like the idea of that. Plus like a... Yeah, I, I don't know, I really like this. I like the idea of like a sleeping thumbs up person. Or a sleeping heroic person. <laughs> don't ask me why. Wait, why does it say February 12th in my image? February 12th? What are you talking about? I didn't take, think the date would be wrong. Oh, you're taking a picture of yours? Yeah, I don't know, man. Okay, this time I'm just gonna go through the game as fast as possible. Get to where I was. Let's go, let's go. I don't have time! This is mad woman running around. Gimme, gimme, gimme! I'm speed running. It, that's one thing I want to see. I want to see someone try to speed run this game. Has anyone ever tried speed running a survival game? That sounds sounds like a terrible time. <laughs> sounds like a terrible, terrible time. What happens if? What happens if I... 
Yay! <laughs> so bad. All right. Yeah, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna be going solo here this time around. Okay. Also, I I've learned a little bit more on how to do things, so I want to increase my strength. Space. They already gave me a ton of cards, I just didn't... Perception. Did they? Oh, they didn't. Okay, alright. No, that's fine. I did get a pack, question mark? <laughs> um... Okay, alright. I do only have one. Gladiator. Alright. This is fine. Just chatting. Oh yeah, it's still on just chatting. I gotta switch it back. Switching it back, switching it back. Twitch. Welcome to my desktop, everyone. Two viewers. <gasps> uh, all out. Please. Thank you for the reminder. This is what you see if you win tab. Oh, actually, I can, I can probably. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what happens to me too. It's it's like a scrolly thing. I don't like it. <laughs> Win tab sucks. All tab all the way. I appreciate the no man's sky with show me what you've got. <laughs> I appreciate that. Because No Man's Sky, did it show what it's got? Like where we le left wanting. Screw you, robot! Also, if you've ever played the old, the old, um, Fallouts, this is very similar exit like the old ones had the twist around like that uh the new ones have like a machine that goes in i know that this one also has the machine that goes in but it looks a lot more like the like the old fallout one and two all right i wonder if at low so clearly like the frame rate still not great. I wonder if I put the game at low if I'm gonna get something better or if there's a different problem altogether. This is on medium. I have to restart the game, which is fine. I mean, I'll do it. I wonder how bad it looks. And, um,. Uh, How much performance it improves. <laughs> See, we are kindred spirits. I just don't know what chicken and waffles are. Been your background for two years. Yeah, it had been a while too since I switched my background. I, I'm the type of person that if I like a background, I'll keep it for years. I don't need to like switch it all the time. Some people just need to keep switching it. I love concept art. It's rare that I have like a funny image <laughs> as my wallpaper. I love concept art. Uh, what's this? Play. 
What was that? But... I, I, I love concept art. Concept art is fantastic. I had the concept art for Metal Gear Solid 3, that scene where Snake, spoilers, kills the boss. Uh, <laughs> and all the flowers are red and stuff. I had the concept art for that scene as, as my wallpaper for a long time. The last background I actually intentionally created would have been more than 10 years ago. Interesting. So you created this, I'm guessing. The... Look at that. It doesn't improve frame rate at all. And the game looks like trash now. Look at that. It, it looks terrible. And the frame rate is still dipping. So there's literally no reason to lower the quality. Oh. oh. Oh, no. Give a little listen. Seems you should meet her at her camp just down the road. Oh, Shadow Poppin. Don't play this on low, guys. Do not play this on low. Do not play this on low. Okay. Okay. It didn't really seem to have too much of a, a performance improvement, so you don't touch to low. Find the overseer. I I have you everyone says I have used many auto or mo motorcycle images back in the day <laughs> 4x3 which uh, doesn't work now yeah I hate that I had so many wallpapers that I got like as when I was younger and I was like yeah this is my wallpaper collection but now I look at them and it's a tiny little JPEG in the middle of the screen and I'm just like oh man <laughs> those, those were different days those were different days this tiny, tiny square of image, and then a color, a flat color around it. Or you could stretch it. <laughs> you know how that works. I hate when people stretch images as backgrounds. Stretched images, it's like... <sighs> you, one does not stretch an image, ever. Sometimes I see posters like in malls and stuff where the image is stretched. I'm like, you were paid. You were paid to do this. I would fix this for free. <laughs> the stretched, any stretched image is literally the worst. It was one thing that was very interesting to me in college was that in our design class there was this guy who was terrible at design so whenever we had presentations his the pictures he showed they were all always stretched and with like the worst most basic like colorful text so like a bright red or a bright green text on like on top of the image you know like really really terrible stuff and it's like we're we're in college for this man how can you how can you do that? It it was it was terrible. Like Yeah, no, it it made me made me very sad. <laughs> Did I man mention when I worked in T in IT and sa I set someone's monitor to a non <laughs> native resolution because that was the only way to solve what the person was asking for. You're giving me flashbacks. Oh man, no, there's so many horror stories like that. Like, I, I love a good image. Like, I love using Photoshop and editing images. It's just also something I just like to do. And whenever I see something that 
Is that horrendous? I'm just... Ooh. It's not fun. It is really not fun. Mm. But yeah, honestly, like... I, I wouldn't recommend anyone to buy this game. I didn't buy this game. Uh, someone gave it to me for free, which was very kind of them. Um, but I think it, it could be fun to to play these this game with with friends, especially if it ran better. Because in the end, like, it, it's something that people did really want for the longest time. They wanted a Fallout game that they could play online. And this is technically all it is. Right? Is that a chicken? <gasps> chicken! This is the most resilient chicken. Are you serious? How many woods can I gather? <laughs> hey, don't. I I I agree. I am wrong. I am mistaken. It's uh. You're right. Most resilient chickens are are in. Zelda, and they're not only the most resilient, they are somehow the most deadly chickens in the world, so they're they're two for two. <laughs> Zelda chickens. They know what's up. They they could dominate the world. They really wanted to, so Man, honestly, th this makes me sad, because like I enjoy Fallout. I like Fallout. I like the... I even like just walking around in the map of Fallout. And even if I'm just thinking about that with this game, it's still something hard to do just because of the performance. So like, even at that lo level, the level of me that just wants to walk around the map, they make it hard. Which sucks. Because I would enjoy, I would legitimately enjoy just walking around the map and like, finding stuff. Can I fish? Wait a minute. I can't fish. Is it junk? Oh. Why do you tease me? Boosh! Boosh, I restarted by the way. I restarted. <laughs> so I am... Right? <laughs> wow, shittiest fox ever. Have you met a fox in real life? No. I didn't realize for the longest time how small they were. Like, I thought they were dog-sized, but apparently they're smaller. And I didn't know that. <laughs> they don't say on the dock for you to kill them. Oh, really? That was a part I thought was realistic about this game. Oh, why did you restart? It's because I met someone and we started doing missions. I was like, that's not really what I want to do. And then there were like, I had a billion mission prompts and that was causing my OCD to get bad. <laughs> so I, I was like, okay, no, I'm not going to do this. I can't do this. Now I, I feel like I just, I just can't do it anymore. <laughs> but yeah, now I'm just fast tracking to where I stopped. Which was literally the next point point in the game. I didn't really do anything past that on my own. After that, I was just like traveling around and seeing whatever the other person built, so... Put perks into intelligence? Don't tell me why. I'll figure it out. 
Thank you for the tip, though. Sure, I'll take that. Uh, it's a quest. Okay. Oh no, the list. <laughs> the list. Old man, 41. Hello. Alright, so what do I have to do? Find the overseer's camp. Uh here we go again with the with these people and their Okay. How Overseer's log, south of Vault 76. I, I knew this wasn't going to be the Appalachia I remember, but then get the Lone Wanderer. It gives you more XP, not in team. No people so far. Um. Yeah, I did hear about the Lone Wanderer being a thing. Like a perk. I did hear about that. You see this? The cooking station? The stash box? So. Craft a piece of armor, craft a weapon. That's what it wants me to do. Okay. Construction and assembly mobile platform is designed to give you one. Just add resources, planning. I'll make a board. And a little elbow grease. Yeah, I'm making a board. Did I make a board? Ready to be placed back down in the new area. Use this to establish a foothold whenever you're in unfamiliar territory. I've left my camp behind so you can use it. Leather chest piece. I'm breaking my own advice by not taking it with me. But after seeing Appalachia for myself, I need to make sure every red... Grabbing everything! ...has a safe haven they can start from. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The game's bugged. <laughs> if it's still standing, the town of Flatwoods is further down oh. this road. You gonna run? Find me there. This is the Overseer. Signing off. Uh, actually, let me see. I'm gonna I'm gonna equip peril, my arm. Yeah, I'm gonna put on the glasses. I'm gonna become the the most hipsterish hipster ever. Oh, hello, Boosh. Haven't seen you yet. <laughs> How are you? Uh, all right. No, no, no. Ah, no, <laughs> so many buttons, <laughs> there's so many buttons, I, I'm just getting confused, alright, space, now I press G, I think, T, no it's T, repair, perfect, now I exit, now I look at it, I craft now, I go light armor, I go, Left arm and right arm. Which one do I have with one arm? Really doesn't help that they look exactly the same. I have right arm. Okay, so I'll, I'll do left arm then. Boom, craft. Right armor, left arm. Make. There we go. Looking good. Right? Hell yeah. Alright. I don't like this old man's 41. He's probably 41 years old. He's probably not even old. Oh. Oh. That was being smart coming out here. Okay, it's... I'll take that. I'll just take these, I'll read them one day. <laughs> one day I'll read them. I'm not even gonna read them now. Okay, 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 okay. 
Is there anything I can't use? Well, I can't use that for a... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um... Don't do overseer stuff, it's not worth it. I have heard that as well, I'll be completely honest. I have heard that. <laughs> that overseer stuff is absolute crap. I am... I'm way better off if I just go have fun and look for dumb stuff to do around the world. And explore. Um... Honestly, that's what I've heard, so... You. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. There's so many prompts, man. <laughs> All right. Pipe guns. I can just find one. I can just go to where I was and find one. Also, I do have a mission. Yeah, the hollow tape thing. Data. First contact. Side. This. US government requisition holotapes have you. One user codes that allow a request supply drop from any operational radio relay. But I need to repair the relay tower. It's a mission I have. Why do you insist so much on melee, Boosh? I think I'm still gonna visit Flatwoods just so I, I get a... Oh, it's all nearby. Um, I'll just... I'll just go. Powder. I thought I thought that said swinging meat. Swinging meat. But yeah, that's the thing. Like the game itself looks fine. Like visually, it's fine. It's it's really the. Oh. 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 Okay. There's no way for me to dodge. Ooh, frame rate. Come on. Hello. Rag sag. They look different from the other games. It's cool. Small detail, but it's kind of laggy. The stream, yeah, I mean, the game itself is kind of laggy, as you can probably see. Again, I do wonder if how much streaming is being a, a factor here <clears throat> for the performance of the game. Automated warning to all responders. Mr. Phone hands are out of control. Supervisors. Once they're dealt with, you'll have to reboot the server. Again. Oh, what are you? Possum. Awesome. More money, wrench. I also don't know how much. And I've mentioned this before, but I don't know how much scrap is... How much junk is important in this game. Whereas there seem to be a little bit more use for it in... In, uh... Fallout 4, I don't exactly know the usefulness of it here. 
I just not have, I, I just think I don't have bobby pins. But yeah, that's the thing, like, if this is, this is the entire game just exploring, and it's a huge map, honestly I'm okay with it, it's... It's really right now what's getting to me, not right now, right now, it's the performance, and... Really, that's it. <laughs> This is the performance that keeps dipping. That's my biggest gripe with the game. Like, I'm not... I'm not here expecting anything bigger from the game. Like, a lot of people were expecting something else, I think, when they were coming into this. I genuinely just want... a nice Fallout world that I can explore. Because many times, in Fallout 4, I didn't even do any missions at all. I just explored the map. So, in a way, you know, a lot, one of the things that people were complaining a lot in not having story, it doesn't even matter to me. Just because I wasn't even playing the story in the ones that did have it. A lot of stuff here. Can... Oh. I'm just standing there. Okay, let's see. You're level 70. Never heard of steel. Let's change just the game. The map is good. The hard part is leveling up at high level. In this game, you need to do missions if you want to level up. Interesting. Yeah, like... So then, that puts a, a little bit of a... Kind of a wrench in the... In one of the things I love doing in Fallout games, which is just exploring and leveling up just from doing that. Uh, is that a sausage? It's a hot dog. Uh, like a cherry. Yeah, if that's the case, that's kind of a bummer, because... I don't get to do what I love most. Oh wow, look at that bridge. That's the thing, like, I remember seeing when it, they revealed the game, one thing that I thought was cool was the verticality of both for and this game, they were using like a lot of big mountains you could scale and stuff like that. And so like the map itself I thought was really cool. I press the button. Hush. I think it's recording now. Shush. Hello. Hello there. Oh, I think it's working. <laughs> I hate these things. This is Willie May. And I was asked to talk a bit about my life since the war help educate future children someday. I think that's nice. I thought I'd just watch my programs and entertain the grandkids in my retirement. But that didn't turn out to be the case. I'm just glad they all made it to the vault in time, you see. When I saw it in a dream, I knew my prayers were answered. My husband Frank used to work in the mine. Just before the war. Oh, okay. News of truth. Yeah, whenever there's a some, whenever there's an enemy on screen, the game just halts. Like frame rate just tanks. Man, the... That's another thing I'll complain about this game. The messages are long. The messages are long. Like, I lose interest in them <laughs> way earlier than, like, they're even close to being done. Let's see. Bombs fell when I was a kid. My dad died in the war. 
Sorry, Brahmin. What the hell? What the hell? So Dasa found me when I was 13 or so. Where that cow go to? What? Taught me everything. I became a volunteer. Great. For the past five years, I've been a responder myself. I help kids who lost their families. I get them safe, trained, just act like a big brother. Every year we find fewer. So yeah, I haven't. I haven't. The map is good. Hard part is leveling up. This. I'm not good. This one is level based, so do events and missions to level up. Still very exploration based. <laughs> Holy shit, Bush is going up on the chat here. I know. Fallout 4. Fallout and Fallout 7 see how the same game engine. Yeah. Just turn them off. Yeah, like, I don't like that they autoplay. That's also something that I'm like, eh, autoplay. I have to go in and, and turn it off. I think it stopped. I think it stopped. Is that how you stop it? Does it just stop? <laughs> I hope. Um, but yeah, they are the same engine and it shows. It definitely shows. It feels like they've just added stuff on top of Fallout 4. <laughs> I mean, like, feature-wise for the engine. in the distant future. Uh, Dasa told us these tapes would be used okay, how, how do I stop? No. Ah, hello. Okay, okay. I did it. I did it. <laughs> I did it. Alright. But yeah, it's just, I, I like the exploration. It's just that since, if it is really gonna force me to, to do missions and stuff like that, like... I would rather just explore. I really would. So yeah, it doesn't seem like I get experience from from killing things. I don't know. Maybe I do. I, I'm just not paying atten attention. But yeah. Oh, I was here with three cooking lessons. So I have to learn how to cook things. Which is interesting. <laughs> better graphics, at least. Hands clapping. The thing is, like, it's better graphics, but the performance is so bad. Like, I would rather have performance, if I'm being honest. I I rather have performance. I know, like, that's that depends a lot, like, from person to person, but... I am much more of a performance guy. Take that as you will. You do get XP from killing things? Ooh, a revolver. Is that my first gun? In this run? No, I had. My pistol, which one does... The revolver does a lot more damage. It has... Oh, I do have a lot. The sickle is a weapon. Interesting. <laughs> Alright. Kitchen terminal. Let's see. Okay. Uh, I'm pantry set. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna get the the hollow tape. I think I maybe need a need to listen to it or something interview two Reverend Delbert Winters hi I met you in the woods near the Morgantown do I need to listen to the whole thing if I want flowers why uh, I was uh, harvesting lots of 
much stuff, Ashley. I, I hunted deer recently. Is that the event? Strange, but tasted fine. Oh. Okay. Well, what's a basic easy Kill farmhand so supervisors. Okay, it's that thing that talked to me in the beginning. All right. Uh, I want to I want to kill the farmhands. That sounds fun. <laughs> kill farmhands. Kill farmhands. Where am I? So to my right. Okay. No, that's the wrong thing. I keep expecting the map to be in there, but it's not. Console is better for Fallout 76. It has better handling. Really? Interesting. Huh. You don't usually hear that. Especially with Bethesda. Bethesda is known for their... Oh, there's a... Yeah, you do, you do get very little, very little, uh, experience from... Uh, alright, alright, Miss Overseer, you... Oh, no. I didn't think there were ghouls in this game. I thought it was just the other type. Oh, someone else. Proceed to the ag center and get to the mainframe. You need to reset the farmhand targeting parameters. That should keep our people safe in the area. Be careful. I guess this is kind of cool that it has like events like that. I'm okay with that. I am a okay with that. I get potato crisps. Higher level of the enemy, more XP. Yeah, I mean that makes sense, but. What I'm wondering is also, oh, what's this? My stash. Wait a minute, so in my stash, does it, if any stash I go, is it there? Is it something that, to whichever one of these I find, I can just trade between each one? Or is it unique to each specific box? Because if it's something that's interchangeable, then I can leave a few things in here and not worry about... Scrap items. Yeah, you do have the scrap all junk, which is fine. It's universal. Cool. Cool. That, that's good to know. That is good to know. I'm never going to use this. Actually, unless the conditions actually make it worse, in which case I might want to try to find. So that's good to know. So I will... Hmm. I'm still good on weight, I think. See what I have. Ammo, mods, junk. I'll just keep that. Yeah, there doesn't seem to be too much. Ooh, awesome op opossum base. Blah, 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 blah. Can't talk. Uh. I don't seem to have too much. 80 doesn't seem to be too much weight to be carrying around anyway, so. I hear a lot of shooting. Say like that. Also, I've seen a lot more people than I thought I'd see uh, throughout playing this game. So, I guess that's sort of a plus.
Also, I'm dying, so I should eat something. Chicken thighs. Didn't I? I cooked that. Thirsty too. I'm a thirsty boy. All right. Purified water. All right. Mmm. Oh, well, that's that's a good tip. That's a good tip. Like to me, I know I've, I've said this multiple times now, but the frame rate really is the big, the big problem for me. Like genuine, genuinely, I think I would, I would enjoy just doing whatever with this game. It's not, it's not as hard as it looks to stay hydrated and full. Just don't get diseases. <laughs> Just don't get diseases. You know, you know, don't get sick. Am I collecting anything? I don't know if I'm collecting anything. Am I collecting anything? <gasps> A gnome! Wow, this is some heavy rain. Wow, it's even breaking through the gate I put on the microphone. Huh. Interesting. Give me one second. I'm going to make sure that the I do have all the windows closed because it's some heavy rain. So give me one second. Also awesome, awesome Boosh, thank you very much. Alright, I'm back. I'm just getting getting a little bit of water here. I'll, I think I kind of have my... Obviously, I won't be able to finish the game to give give a good idea of, of what I thought. But, like, my thoughts right now, my... Uh, 
Um, I think this is... It's a lot less bad than, you know, what we hear, hear about it. And that's honestly what I expected. I expected a lot of it, not to be blown out of proportion, but the, the impact and effect that those things had to be a lot smaller. However, there, like to me, the big problem has been performance. I, I want a game to at least be able to run consistently. Uh, and that's like the biggest thing I found playing today so far. And I've played for three hours now. Um, which is not that much, but I mean, the performance has already been, you know, not the best. But I could definitely see this as just a relaxing game you hop into and just build some stuff and have fun in that way. Hello, are you evil? You are. Uh... What? And honestly, to me... I would genuinely come back and just play and chill in this game. Uh... <laughs> if perform what performance wasn't so abysmal. Yeah, that's... I came in really wanting to discover how this game really was. I wanted to see the state of the game. I really wanted to be able to compare to the things we've heard and everything. And I can say that the game itself, not nearly as bad as or as terrible. It is Fallout minus the story. <laughs> which, again, because of the way I play, I personally am fine with it. Some people loved doing quest lines and storylines, meeting characters, you know. How many pe times have we heard about, oh, I love that companion, I love this companion. That's something that to me didn't really matter uh, because of the way I played. So, yeah. <laughs> Go somewhere, trade it in, get it for PlayStation. It's so much better. Yeah, that's the thing though. Like, I, I got this for free. I got this from someone who didn't want it anymore. So, I'm thankful in the way that I was able to try it. It's something I really wanted to do. I wanted to give this game a fair shot, but I'm not I can't trade it and get it for a different <laughs> different uh platform. I would actually love love to. I would love to be able to just review it and see what's up, but Sadly, I cannot, given my, my situation. It is not something that I'm probably going to be putting more money into, even that I haven't put any money into it. Uh, but yeah, it's definitely an experience that I wanted to have. Finding a lot of money. I wonder if there is a setting. So now, also get a PS4. <laughs> you know, you know, just just put down all the money for a PS4 to to play Fallout 76. <laughs> There's one thing I want to see. So, actually, before I check this, can you play? Uh, I'm gonna go back to the menu so I, I don't get killed or anything. But one thing that I want to check is that if on PC there are some settings that cause the frame rate to go down. So maybe by turning down one setting, I can 
uh, improve the game. So I'll be looking at that. Far, load, 76, frame rate, PC settings. So is it a bit of benchmark? I don't know. Mouse fix? I'm actually finding the mouse to be fine. Custom any. V-Sync forcefully enables and disables. Uh, Fallout. Better performance PC settings. Optimization performance tweaks. There we go. It's better with friends. Go into your, your map. Look at someone around you. Yeah, that's the thing. Everyone's so high level. And... Right now, I, again, it's, I love being lone wolf in this game, given that there's a perk named that, so I'll just, I do enjoy that, so I'm, I'm genuinely okay, that, that is not a problem that I'm having with, with the game, it being lonely or anything like that. Um... File does not need file property to be changed to read only. If you do change it to read only, the settings you change in game will not be saved. I don't care for grass. I actually like the fog. So this guy changed a bunch of stuff, but... Then go to audio settings and turn, turn off push to talk. Then you, then go do quest to get a turn shower and go to him. I'll be back. <laughs> All right. I I just want to. Several game DVR. I did that. Repair your PC registry. Switch to a wired connection. Must. What if we can't? This, this this seems interesting. Kill ping is a ping reducing gaming software. Where you should get uh, hence dedicated gaming service which allow you to play. Maybe we're going to dedicate. Let me look at this. This looks interesting. I don't think it's kill ping. Is this paid? Start. For free. Uh, 
Okay. Uh, yeah, it's paid. All right. I mean, you would expect that. Tweaking guide. <laughs> All right. Okay, before you go into Fallout PC Tweaks Guide, a few steps you need to follow. First, go to your phone, look at my games, sorry, documents folder. Need to locate, change the name to custom any. Be careful about the extension. Once your game, once you are gone, with your, when you're done with this, a text is changing. No, I'm gonna do this. Let's close the game. Let's do this. It's a desktop. Let's see if it, how much, and if it does improve performance. I'm very curious to see like how much this is actually going to affect. Um, yeah, performance. Games. No, this is the wrong one. The, the, the documents. Documents, my games, Fallout 76. Prefs, let's... Prefs, I need to change the name to custom. Oops. Whoops. Uh, I don't know how to type. Custom. It just all right <laughs> uh, I'm gonna add some spaces here so I don't terrain manager bam image space lighting shader LODs grass water texture Weather general. That's enlighten main. Oh, culling interface controls gameplay particles. Save game, audio menu. Every 10 minutes it saves, uh, auto saves. Voice, landscape. Okay. okay. Volumetric lighting, texture quality. Yeah, we'll, we'll see here. Search volume lighter, change it value from one to zero. I'm gonna do all the things here. We'll see how bad the game looks versus how well it runs. Shadow filter, da -da. shadow distance, shadow map resolution, shadow filter. Volumetric. Screen split. Yeah, location. Okay. Hey, back. Would have been popular if it was a battle royale. <laughs> I always treat some Fallout 76 later if you want to see me. Uh, from your point of view. I might check it out. That, that'll be in a few hours. I might check it out. Mm. B. Fog. 
There's no B fog. Search for B fog enabled. All right. Taylor seems TAA, that's fine. Most window, maximum window, da da da, decals. Okay, this is a separate thing. Terrain manager, image space. Zero. Zero. Do not need screen space reflections. LODs are fine. Grass. Go for 35. Water. High res, no. Water displacement. Story manager line, da, da, da. I don't know what that is, I'm not gonna mess with it. Pit boy. Image contrast, save on travel, save on rest. This is all stuff that you could find in the, this is pretty much Fallout 3. <laughs> How Fallout 3 was, was run. Dialogue subtitles. I put yes, but it didn't it didn't register, so I'm actually turning that on here. Dialogue camera enabled. Uh, sensitivity. You play difficulty too, sure. Max desired five hundred. Audio menu, this is fine. Push to talk. Landscape. Settings of the game. These settings cannot be affected by upcoming updates. I mean, let's see, let's see if that alone did something. Let's just check this one. Uh, 
Oh, that that's actually a good idea, doing the NVIDIA stuff. It might be a little laggy since everyone in our Wi-Fi, but it'll still play fine. Later, I'll whisper you when I'm going to start streaming. All right, sounds good. Sounds good. Coolio beans. Let's see. Our program settings. Mm, we're all out. F. It's not an alphabetical order, is it? Oh, it was... no, wait. Uh... Where is it? Where's Fallout? Uh, okay. Bethesda games, Fallout 76, Fallout 76. All right, let's see what settings they have here. Manage 3 settings, program settings, maximum pre-rendered. Frames. Maximum pre rendered frames, one. Uh, set monitor technology sync to G sync, nah. Thread, threaded optimization, enable threaded. Uh, threaded optimization on. Set power management to prefer maximum performance. Power, power management. Adaptive is fine. Um, multi display, makes your PX series, single display performance. The single display performance mode. I'm using two display. Picture filtering to performance. Change that. Perform. Alright, apply. Use your priority of the game. Be effective for using draft cries completely lower VRAM. I'm fine with that. Okay. Let's let's check the game out. Let's see how it runs. Hmm. I am going to change those things he, he did mention on the on the thing as well. Hoping for the best. Uh, settings. Display. Lighting quality. Yes, medium, low. Oh, wait. Controls. restart the game. I might have undone a lot of what I did by putting it on the preset again, but that's fine. 
If I can just fix it with in-game settings, not fix it completely, but improve it, that makes me a lot happier because Bethesda games and messing with their any files many times can lead to problems, <laughs> which, you know, I would rather not have, so... We'll see. See how it looks. Almost heaven, West Virginia. Too bad that song's not in the game, given that they, you know, I believe, no, that was for the last game, that they used it without permission, <laughs> and the author got angry, the artist got angry, because <laughs> he specifically said he didn't want any games where they were shooting, or any movies where they were shooting, and Fallout, there's a lot of shooting, <laughs> so, you know. It was the, the the one for Fallout 4, the song that was used in all the ad material. Well, yeah, let's see how it looks with these settings. Looks and runs. Oh no, it reset all my settings? Okay, give me a sec. <laughs> Uh, game, like sensitivity, to the lowest, you can go. Settings. Did it reset all my controls? No, okay. That's good. <laughs> That's good. It did not reset my controls. I think actually for for today that's that's gonna be pretty much all I do. I'm not going to be uh, playing too much longer today. And yeah, I'll get to. Uh... Oh, it's the same mission. Yeah. Automated warning to all responders. Mr. Phone hands are out of control. Evacuate civilians. I do want to see how it performs without the streaming. See if it changes anything. Yeah. Yeah, that, that'll be all for me today. Uh, I'll just finish exploring this church up top here. More money. Pillow. Comfy pillow. Coffee pot. Chemistry station. More money. Also, this church, the layout of this church is straight up lifted from Fallout 4. <laughs> there are, there's a lot of asset flipping happening, happening in this game, I'll be honest. <laughs> Leather right arm. So I said, okay. My, name, my name's Colonel. That's a big part of it, is the streaming. I just wanted to say, I'm sorry. <laughs> Tell you when I'm, I'm streaming. Yeah, I wanna, I'll be, I'll be... Bombs and 
busy for a little while, but I'll I'll hop in for, if I can for sure. I am curious to see, you know, a different perspective on it as well. But yeah. But yeah, it was definitely an interesting experiment that I I wanted to do. Really, kind of seeing what this game was all about. And honestly, I feel like I only scratched the surface, and I do want to kind of go back to it. I don't know if I'll do it on stream, but. I might go back to it. Um, I might come back to it if I do play it more. And seeing it. Impacts restore 50 more health. Nice. Okay. All right. But yeah, I will. I will definitely be be seeing. Anyway, thank you so much, everyone, for watching. <laughs> Is it that bad? Yes. Uh. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, I will. See everyone later. Also, hello, Dan and JT. And yeah, I will see you all soon. Probably on Monday. I'll probably be streaming more on Monday. But yeah, take care, everyone. Let me say goodbye.